Hi W, I'm Luke Hirschson and today we're doing a transformative haircut on Mars. It's a classic haircut that really started my career. I did this similar kind of haircut on one of my first big career breaks. It was a shoot for W Jewelry uh, back in 2001. Um, and it was based on a shape that was worn by Linda Evangelista, Demi Moore. It's quite a boyish but really chic haircut. I think it's gonna look great on her. I like to cut hair, um, I actually like to cut hair a lot dry, but I wanna get the, the base of the shape in when it's wet, and then we'll probably do quite a bit of dry cutting as well um, towards the end. So when I'm doing this haircut, it always reminds me of like, some of my first like references that I ever really got that inspired by. I remember being like in New York in the late 90s and buying Peter Lindbergh's book. Um, and there were all these amazing pictures of Linda with like center partings and curtains like this. And uh, it's something that still feels like super timeless. Yeah, so I've, I've started kind of center parting all the way down. I'm, I'm kind of concentrating on getting a really nice head shape. So. You're gonna see I'm gonna take the, the nape of the neck really, really tight, almost as short as I can hold my fingers. Um, and then we're gonna build up the weight as we get to the crown. So almost following, following her head shape, really. And you can see kind of like just in the hairline here, um, you know, this is slightly different to how you'd cut like a traditional like man's haircut. So we've come a little bit more into a point which kind of follows a little bit more of her head shape. So it just feels that much softer. So this haircut, it's, um, it's all about the sides and the back being quite short. And you can see I'm, I'm really leaving the length on the top because it's all about that balance between the sides being quite tight and framing the face and the top having quite a lot of weight and length to it. Haircuts for me have always kind of been so important. I, I think um, they've always, I've always done a lot of haircuts even when I'm shooting. Um, I think probably because of my salon background, people have always trusted me to, to do haircuts. You don't see an enormous amount of that and when you go on, on set to do a sitting. Um, but they kind of form the foundation of everything. You'll see when I start styling it, you can, this is really great slicked back. It's great to make a little boyish quiff. Uh, it's super nice with like full bangs. I think it's like this haircut is it's a little bit like bobs. They're um they're kind of timeless, you know. There's always different, slightly different versions of them, but they always tend to have a place. They never t they never seem to feel kind of dated. There's like a timelessness to them. I mean, even you can see like, just, you know, combing it, I kind of love the shapes that it, that it creates on her. Um, when you start seeing, you know, the sides come wide and you see these really nice shapes, you know, it's such a juxtaposition to her, to her beautiful face and, you know, how, how boyish it is against, against that. There's something really chic and classic about that. So in terms of styling, I mean, this is a kind of haircut you can leave pretty natural. You don't even have to dry it. I've just done it for speed. And just to pull out a little bit of the cow's lick that she has at the front. Uh, but as you can see, I've just done that by stretching my hands through the hair, just to pull the wave out. Um, and then in terms of product, I've just used a little bit of my Almost Everything Cream, um, a couple of pumps, and um, just rub it into the hand. The thing is with product is a little goes a long way. So don't overload it. You can always build up. You can always add more as you go. But you can see it just brings a little shine in and creates a little bit more texture without giving you any kind of look of it being greasy. I like this when there's no real parting to it, but as I said, I think it's super nice off her face as well. Um, and then as I said, you know, with the comb marks, wet, I think it's great a little bit of oil or just overload it with the cream. 
Okay, so that's pretty much it for the haircut. Uh, we're gonna put a little makeup on, um, get dressed, and we'll see you guys in a bit. So that's the look. Uh, totally transformative haircut from the shaggy mullet to super 90s, Demi Moore, Linda Evangelista bowl cut. I think she looks amazing and it's really versatile to style so she can wear it super natural like this or slick back as we spoke about or even the, the curtains I really like in the center part. So lots to do, lots to play with. Um, yeah, and I think she looks amazing. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm Luke Hersherson, this is Mars. If you've enjoyed it, please subscribe and let us know what you think by leaving a comment below.